doing well. Thank you for asking. So let's talk about booze today. What oh. is what is alcohol? Well, there's a lot of things I could say about alcohol, but um, in general, it's a substance that kills cells completely. It's a, it's a great item for for sterility, I guess. If you want to sterilize equipment, yeah. Or cleaning equipment, you know, like, um, medical equipment they use alcohol, or if you can get swabbed for an injection. So alcohol kills cells, and uh, yeah, is that what you're or drinking? You mean drinking alcohol? Yeah. What is it made out of? How the you know? Well, oftentimes, chemically, biochemically. Well, oftentimes is the is the waste product of an organism, such as like wines and beers and so forth. Um, you feed the yeast organism, the organism um, excrements, and the excrement is what people consume is the alcohol. So we're eating shit, basically. People are eating shit and drinking shit, and they think that's something that alleviates their pain and suffering. When in reality, it's because they're eating bad foods, including all meat products, dairy, eggs, fish, whatever. And um, and their vessels are so constricted and so blocked up and constipated, and the pressure is so painful that the alcohol is gonna gonna not release the pressure, but it's gonna take the, the it's gonna numb someone. It's gonna numb you. So that's the effect it has on you. It just numbs you. It doesn't wake you up at all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So basically, you said that that alcohol is the excrement excrement of living organisms of the of the yeast of any, any organism. Yeah, but yeast, especially bacteria and so forth, it's it's going to be the alcoholic effect. It's an acidic. Um, it's a substance that is uh, maybe not. As so what's the best acidic. solution for you to quit alcohol? Because you used to be an alcoholic oh, yeah, before. I was alcoholic. Yeah. Okay. Um, how much did you drink before? Oh my god, in high school I was drinking, um, not all of high school, but I remember I was drinking, um, jeez, a gallon of vodka and orange juice every weekend and throughout the day I, w I would find some way to sneak some sort of alcohol into my uh, a container, or a drinking container, let's say like a sports drink container. So I was drinking a lot, you know, in um, my junior and senior year, I guess mostly of high school. And then from that point on in the military and so forth, I drank, I used to drink so much, it was ridiculous, I, I can't even tell you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, I guess as far as my, my my removal of the alcohol was basically me transitioning and it was a, by accident, completely by accident. I didn't expect myself to want to quit alcohol because I used to fight too, physical fights and you know, you, you think you're having more charm, you think you can attract more women with, with more alcohol and you're a cool guy to hang out with and you're fun, you're the life of the party. But in reality, you're just another loser, another depressed loser, you know, who's, who's substituting you know, reality, you know, this fictional belief system for reality. We're just swapping out, you know, stories. So what I found out when I did a cleanse back in 2004, I was over 210 pounds. I did the simple cleanse, the master cleanse, you know, which is the lemonade stuff with the salt water flushes in the morning. And um, I did that for about seven days. Then, you know, eighth, I, I, I figured I can extend it to 10 days. I did the 10 days, lost a lot of weight, felt really good. And I realized that I didn't, I no longer needed to consume alcohol to feel good about myself, my body. I started knowing myself greater. That's that's my passion to know myself much greater. I mean, I don't care about knowing any more that I need to know about alcohol or eggs or fish or you know uh, <laughs> all this other stuff or religions. I don't want to know all these things. I want to know myself greater. And by removing the stuff I don't need, alcohol being what we're talking about, I found greater happiness in connecting deeper with the people I really care about. And they saw that I was more... So what replaces alcohol today to you? Uh, fruits. I mean, I, I just love eating fruits. fruits so you're still water. addicted. You're just addicted to fruit. Addicted to fruits and running, of course. That's even more, even better than fruits is running, exercising, playing, swimming, yoga. Um, just communicating deeper with the people I really care about. So that's what replaces the alcohol. You know, deeper connection.